Welcome back to The Local Mix. I go by the name of Big Skeezer. We have some dope contemporary Christian artists with us by the name of Have Mercy. How y'all ladies doing? We're, We're doing, doing fine. Right. Thanks All for right. being here. Okay. We're happy. Introduce yourself uh, individually. My name is Naima of Have Mercy. And I'm Tania of Have Mercy. And originally, where you guys hail from? We are originally from New York City. Mm -hmm. I'm from Queens. Long Island, Freeport. Okay, New York. New York is in the house. <laughs> New York is in the house. When did you all start singing? How young were you? Babies. Church. I've been singing, yeah, I've been singing since a child also, but we met each other, yeah. um, I want to say, in 1997. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, whoo, in the parking lot of the mall Green at Acres. Green Acres, Long Island. That's crazy. Long time ago. So, you basically are sisters now. Yes. yes. What was growing up like, you know, coming up? I know it was a musical household. Mm -hmm. what, what were some of the sounds that you guys were hearing? <laughs> I let her answer that. <laughs> <laughs> well, being raised, um, daddy's the pastor, mom's the evangelist. Needless to say, there was no R&B in my house, but um, a lot of gospel going on. I, can I still snuck over my friend's house every day, and, you know, trying to be like SWV and, you know. <laughs> right, 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 right. But that, a lot of gospel singing going on. With you all being contemporary Christian artists, what do you say would be some of the misconceptions that people have? I mean, you guys are fashion forward, you know, yes, already, you yes, can already yes, kill that. Yes, yes, <laughs> You can kill that right now. So what, what, what would you say is some of the misconceptions that you guys deal with? Mm, well, I, I, I think people always say you have to look a certain way to be a Christian or you have to, you know, dress a certain way to praise, praise the Lord. But, you know, God says, come as you are. And me and I, we want to be relatable to people that are not saved so they can come and get saved. Because right. people in the church are already saved. So if we have on our jeans, you know, it's your, about your walk with God. Mm -hmm. You know, you don't worry about people and you don't judge other people. You let them come, you let them have their own walk with God, and if, you know, eventually they turn into uh, long pants and long skirts and hats, then that's what it is. I can then. dig it. I can dig it. My mom's a minister in music, <laughs> and that's one of the main things she used to say is that you're ministering to the sinners. You're, yes. you're trying to bring more, save more souls. So I definitely feel cool. you on that. What's some of you guys' um, influences, early influences? Well, my um, upbringing is a little different than hers. Um, my parents weren't pastors, but we did have um, gospel music in the house, and we also had, you know, R&B in the house as well. So my mixture is uh, like a melting pot. Right. I have the Clark mm -hmm. sisters, mm -hmm. then a little Faith Evans, mm -hmm. a little Whitney Houston. Okay. okay. So you know, that's basically you know Whitney. She grew up uh, with her mother singing Sissy. gospel as well. Yes. So I have the mixed bag, and uh, that's you know how we. Come together, right? Let's talk about this dope video you guys have. Yeah. Um, who shot it? Ah. Um, it's called D Wiz Productions. Mm -hmm. um, called In Focus, and um, they're you know Very people talented. we know, and they were awesome. Yes, I love that video. They did a great job, definitely, and getting across what we the message that we wanted to put out there. What What was the overall message that you guys wanted to wanted to get out there as far as that? Because it, it, it's a it's a yeah. powerful message. I don't want to give out too much because we're going to go to the video, but. Uh, Give them, give them a little bit of what you guys wanted them to hold on to. I think part of it was, you know, you may be looking for something in life and you're determined to get it. And just because you're determined to get it and you want it doesn't necessarily mean that that's what God has in store for you. Mm -hmm. And you keep pushing, pushing, and you, you want it. But you know what? You have to just fall back and stand still and allow him to tell you what is going to happen, what's ultimately going to be, you know, your your place in life. And that, I think at the end of the video, it shows her going and saying, you know what? I'm going to surrender. Right? Yes, you, know? you have to. And put right. God first, and then everything, you know, that he wants for you will be good for you, and everything will be all right. Not saying that we won't have tests and trials, mm -hmm. but it, you'll have a better outcome. Definitely with God. I'm gonna slide off to the uh, Order My Steps video by Have Mercy. Check it out now.
Welcome back, this is a local mix. Once again, I'm Big Skeezer, and we are here with Have Mercy. Yes, yes. We just checked out the uh, Order My Steps video. Mm -hmm. um, how did you guys feel when you first saw it? Is, th is this your first video that you guys have done? Yes. How, 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 what was that rush like? Oh, I was like, oh my goodness. It's exciting. Am I okay? I want it. <laughs> Because I know it was a lot of, miles. Let's know say it was that. a lot of rewinding. <laughs> <laughs> I can dig it. I can Go dig back. it. Well, recently I found out some more information about you guys that you guys write your own music. Yeah. You know what? What is that like? Being able to being able to craft your own stuff without taking any input from anybody else. I love writing our own music because we get to put our own life experience into it. Even sometimes it is other people's situations that are around us and you know what they're going through, and if we can help them, you know, do in a God way, let's say that, then it, you know, I, I love that. I love that because it's relatable. A lot of people go through what you go through. We, they say you're not the first and won't be the last, and that's the exactly. truth. Give them some information on how to contact you. Okay, we will. You can go and find us at H-A-V-M-E-R-C-I, Have Mercy, on Facebook, Twitter, mm -hmm. Reverb Nation. Yes. You also buy our song on iTunes, Order My Steps. Okay, um, if you want to contact our management, you can um, type we are have mercy at gmail.com and make sure you spell it H A V M E R C I and you'll get to us. That's right. Right. That's right. That's right. Spelled wrong for the right reason. <laughs> you heard it here first. Now we're going to slide off to some commercials, come back with some more videos. Y'all stay with us. We'll be right back.